Yay, so again, just about one hour later and Mount Fuji looks like this. Behind, behind the Mount Fuji full of clouds, although not really thick clouds. So we are really lucky to be on this side. And hi everyone. So this is the hotel, this here. And there is, uh, this is a coffee shop. And then there is there one more hotel, excuse me. Uh, here is the bus stop where the bus would drop you off. So you have some toys and there are, you know, if you walk along the uh, road, there is a convenience store, but it's a kind of really far. So basically it's not so full of people, not so developed yet. We don't have any Hilton hotel or stuff like that. But I'm so happy with this traditional Yamadaya hotel where I stayed. Uh, especially because as you saw the room was Japanese style with um, uh, onsen, like the hot spring. <laughs> Yay! So now we are going to take bus for a next location. And I just wanted you to see one more time Mount Fuji before we leave. So yeah, that's what I'm telling you. It's really tricky and you got to be really lucky to have nice weather and uh, yeah, we were incredibly lucky I would say. <laughs> Isn't this absolutely stunning? Like even with those clouds, this is the total photographer's dream. <laughs> Yay. <sighs> so this is it. Here is the bus stop. As you can see, many, many foreign people. And this bus can take you um, around the lakes. So yeah, here is one more hotel, but the view is kind of lateral, not straight to Mount Fuji. So this was the Lake Shoji Mount Fuji angle, which I say it's definitely the best that you can get. And yeah, one more coffee shop, Fujimi coffee shop. Yay! <laughs> so we really had many videos, but I am so happy to be here. And I really hope that if you come to Japan, uh, that you know about this because I had to search with Google Street View to find this spot. It's not really known, so that's why I'm making so many videos so that you people know about it. <laughs> so, see ya in the next video. Mount Fuji, say bye to people. <laughs>